Performing the magic for me is not about convincing anyone I have amazing abilities. It's about providing a journey which comes to a place where the brain starts spinning. And of course, the best brains spin the most. So I understand you are a bit of a magic fan and that you are or were something of a, an amateur magician. Yes, when I was a boy, I used to get all those wonderful books, um, all those books on, on card magic in particular, card and coin magic. I've never been a great one for display and cabinet magic for large lacquered boxes and disappearing mm. women. Oh, do, uh, do light up, by oh, the way. Thank you. Yeah. Thought, yeah. It's interesting that magic does seem to appeal to uh, creative and often quite isolated teenage and kids, a young mentality, but yourself, if that's okay to say that. Woody Allen, of course, used to be... Absolutely. I mean, there's a theory that it's the revenge of the nerd, that it's the rather yeah. kind of uh, ignored and hopeless child who's not good on the games field, who, yeah. who can kind of fool his co-evils. And in that sense, a bit like comedy. You can get one over on the, the big chaps because you can actually fool them and you can make them go, bloody hell, how do you do that? How can you do it? What? Come on, you know. And they're the ones who could otherwise would beat you up. There's some, some element of that. Well, perhaps on that note, I should, uh, I should show you a trick. Uh, a card trick, no less. My very favourite. Um, I'm going to spread the cards out on the table and ask you, Millie, to look down and remember one card um, and to really burn the image of that card in your mind. So, for example, it was the three of hearts, then you see a big three and a big heart and burn that into your head. Please don't now go for the three of hearts, right. but uh, any card you like. Are you ready? Yep. I'll look the other way as you do it so I don't sort of catch a glimpse of where you might be looking. Got one? Yes. Yes, marvellous. Thank you so much. Right. Um, thank you. Now, if you look at me, and in your mind, not out loud, obviously, just repeat that card to yourself over and over again. Just over and over again, like King of Diamonds, King of Diamonds, King of Shut Diamonds. Shut up! Was that it? Fuck off! <laughs> Thank you so much. Bloody hell. Sorry, there's a rather extreme reaction, but that is extraordinary. That was a charming reaction. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite brilliant. Thank you. Quite brilliant. Actually, a little more difficult than I thought. Do you know why? Why is that? Well, there is no King of Diamonds in there. No, there was. There was a, um, I'm trying to remember, where was it? In the middle somewhere? Or yeah, absolutely. About a third of the, no, yes. there's a, there's a king, of, king of Hearts, I believe. Uh, king of Hearts. <coughs> oh, for God's sake! <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Your card there, the, uh, the King of Diamonds. Thank you, Stephen. <laughs> Oh, brilliant. Thank you so brilliant. much. Brilliant. Absolutely <laughs> superb. An unpleasant souvenir for you. Oh, my Lord. That is just extraordinary. It's almost like a bad shock. You kind of think, no, no. You, your mind wants to say, no, this is not happening. It's not real. It's not true. I reject it. I reject everything about it. Fantastic. Quite brilliant.